I went to Maranello Sales today to pick up a car I'd bought and while I was looking around the showroom and waiting I saw this very limited edition Ferrari F12 TDF and I just could not take my eyes off this car and well did I end up buying it on an impulse let's find out by watching this video all the way to the end hello I've come to Maranello in Egham to pick up a little run around shall we say and um, I thought I'd show you around a little bit since I'm here because they do have a lot of interesting cars here a lot of nice cars so let's go around and have a look at some of them GTC4 Lusso nice car this is a Lusso T from the wheels nice interior Portofino not sure about that color Portofino not sure about that color Wow look at that a Cali for 80,000 perfect spec cream red beautiful Cali T white not giving you much of a narration am I <laughs> white red gray Cali T 110 488 812 never got tempted with one of these and to be honest with you now that I'm here I'm still not tempted 488 oh nice they've really come down in price these this one is a V12 let's see how much this is 179 grand Wow I had one of the earlier ones of these and I think I paid 280 for it really good value Wow 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 let's go over here and we'll come back nice 488 cream black what else could you want cream and red 458 wow 125 grand come on this has to be high mileage right 488 demonstrator interesting placing of the number plate Kelly T original California Kelly T Kelly T 488 let's check out the price of these so 488 189 123,000 Kelly T 159 beautiful 82 172 wow oh this is a Portofino isn't it hello don't you know your car's power I'm seriously shame on me shouldn't be narrating should I Maserati sounds good this Maserati So where was I before I was rudely interrupted by the Maserati oh yeah we're gonna go inside so see you inside people Marinello's in Egham um, basically it's a dealership of Maserati and Ferrari and while I was here waiting to pick up another car I saw this beautiful blue TDF and um, I wasn't looking to buy another car or a TDF for that matter but um, I just couldn't take my eyes off it this uh, particular car is a well I would say a unique car because it's a very special color um, it's actually called a French racing blue and it has the French 
uh, flag on it as well which some people may say um, it shouldn't have because it's an Italian car but um, the whole theme of it and the fact that it is a TDF to the fans um, it's pretty amazing the way it's been specced and I just couldn't stop looking at it and the more I thought about it as I was standing there the more I already knew at the back of my mind that I'm gonna be walking out of this dealership with this car um, so I had a look inside um, while I was waiting for the other car and um, and yeah I guess the decision was made within the first minute of having seen um, the blue TDF here we have a beautiful red pista which at the moment is one of the hot cars although the pista spider has come out and all the other updates to that particular range are coming out really soon as well and then you have quite a few maseratis here a very stealthy looking black levante and levante seem to be quite popular um right now because as you can see the whole uh, maserati showroom is full of levantes and you also have a very beautiful 812 super fast um, in the showroom here which is kind of the new f12 if you will and to me though um, the tdf is a very very unique car with the way it's designed and the aggressive looks of it and i do know that a new souped up version of the 812 is coming out or a tdf version of the 812 is coming out uh, very soon i don't know where it will go um, potentially i think it will be a similar situation to the sv and the svj whereby most people prefer the sv over the svj and i'm hoping now that i've decided to um, go for this blue tdf that the new 812 tdf won't be as limited or as aggressive looking as the um, f12 tdf but um who knows i haven't bought um the car specifically uh, for investment purposes i just decided to go for it because i really love the way it looked um, and i do think it's a very historic limited um, ferrari which i'll probably enjoy a lot i see it as a piece of art more than anything else this tdf is a tailor-made tdf and there are quite a few nice touches such as the special stitching and the different um, colors and so on they've done on the interior um, i think each tdf has its own kind of uniqueness but i'm um, honestly i've never seen a tdf this amazing um, especially if you see this car in the flesh you'll see what i mean it is it is the most beautiful ferrari i've ever seen no doubt about it mm -hmm. 